Hi, in this video we're going to give you a sneak peek at our upcoming product, which is Cloudberry Remote Assistant for iOS. So this app is pretty much similar to Remote Assistant for Windows. It essentially allows you to connect to your remote computers from your iOS device, such as your iPhone or your iPad, and operate them as if you were sitting right next to them. So you can look at your screen, you can simulate mouse events, you can click on something, you can um, enter some text and stuff like that. So imagine if you are away from your computer, but you need to quickly access some document on it, or maybe you need to help someone resolve their issue on their computer. Cloudberry Remote Assistant for iOS will help you do that in just a few taps. So when you open the app, what you see here is the uh, list of your computers, list of your connections. So what you need to do here is enter the computer ID of the computer you want to connect to. Simply tap on this little white circle and the connection will be initiated. And as usual, you will have to enter the pin code, which is uh, 7354 in this case, and then tap on this little arrow icon. And just like that, the connection is initiated. So you can see we have our Windows computer right here. You can rotate your phone to landscape to get a better view. As you can see, we have a uh, control center right here, which gives you access to your quick shortcuts, to your keyboard, uh, to your screens. Uh, you can also access your chat. Uh, here you can uh, chat with the person you're trying to connect to. Maybe you're helping someone resolve their backup issues so you can chat them or you can request full control or you can just notify the user that everything has been uh, fixed or something like that. Um, you can close the chat. You can request full control by clicking full control and if the user is actually granting you this permission, you can go ahead and uh, drag the mouse. You can uh, click in various places. You can drag files and folders by simply double tapping on a particular file or window and dragging it across the screen. So tap, tap and drag. If you need to use the keyboard, you can uh, open up the control center and uh, initiate the keyboard. Uh, so you can maybe search for some document, uh, some report or whatever. At the top, you see the uh, toolbar that features certain um, useful keys like escape, uh, control, command and alt. Uh, so once you're done, you can just tap on the control center and then you can tap exit and the connection will be dropped. If the remote computer requires encryption, you can tap on this info icon and you can enable encryption, uh, paste the encryption key right here and click OK. Alright, so this has been a quick look at Cloudberry Remote Assistant for iOS. If you have any questions about the app or maybe you have some feedback or want to see certain features, let us know in the comment section below. That's pretty much it for this video. Thank you for watching and we'll see you again in the next video. Bye.